This week's BFI Player Plus choice is One from the Vaults, a film which played to great applause at the Cannes Film Festival in 1974, but which subsequently disappeared from distribution, available only through grainy VHS copies passed between cult horror fans. Jose Larraz's Symptoms. I'm ill. Then let's leave here and go back to London. No. That would be worse. It's much better being here alone with you. For how long? Can't stay here forever, you know. It won't be long now. Credited under the anglicised name Joseph, the Catalonian Larraz made symptoms in the same year as his more infamous vampires. Angela Pleasance, daughter of Donald, is electrifying as Helen, the mysterious young woman who is visited in a remote mansion house by Lorna Helbron's Anne. Together, they walk in the woods, around which lurk Peter Vaughan's estate keeper, and to the waters, which hide dark secrets. Time Out magazine called Symptoms the finest British horror movie from a foreigner since Polanski's repulsion, although modern viewers may be more struck by its weird similarities to Carol Morley's The Falling. Hauntingly lensed by Trevor Wren and intriguingly edited by Brian Smedley Aston, the film casts a heady spell as we're drawn into its strange psychodrama. John Scott's score adds to the ethereal air of unease, while the performances are nuanced and nicely underplayed. Produced by Jean Dupuis, who owed his wealth to the Smurfs, no, really, Symptoms opened to rave reviews, but quickly became a cult oddity, rarely seen in cinemas or on TV, only when the title was flagged up as part of the BFI's most wanted project was the negative located by Deluxe, providing the source of a new digital transfer. When I interviewed Laraz about his film Deadly Manor back in the early 90s, he spoke proudly of symptoms, which I had to confess I hadn't seen. He sighed and said he dreamed that it would find its way back into circulation. Well, thankfully, that dream has now come true. Mm -hmm.